Hey everybody, it's Wolvash. Welcome back to Guacamele. All right, we are down in the uh, Caverna de Pollo. Um, we're just trying to cover some things that looks like it might be side areas. Uh, oh, and it's uh, possible that that is true with this guy hanging out down here. Welcome, senor. The Caverna de Pollo is where the strongest luchadors come to train. If you can meet the challenge, you may even be rewarded. Oh, see? It is something going on down here. Is it just going to be like a, 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 a arena thing or something? Another yeah. Olmec statue. Nice to meet you, sir. I always yeah. interact with them because I'm not sure oh. if I need to do that to actually put them on the map. Remembering my special powers. I don't think that'll work here, though. Yeah, not quite. There's a, a drop down from above, so we might get that chest on a big loop around. Alright, there's a lot going on here in terms of empty space. But, not so much in the ways of being able to actually do anything. Maybe, maybe not. Maybe there's still more to unlock. Because even with my double jump uppercut, that is still too high for me. So, um, this does defeat the idea that... This holds the key to those side quests. I'm not entirely sure how that goes. Um, ooh! What is this? Hey! Speaking of, gracias, senor. I'm grateful to you. Now, let us celebrate with beautiful musica. <laughs> well, speak of the devil, and he shall come. Sweet! And a heart? Yep, that's totally worth it. Well, that solves that. So now we need what? The, uh... We need the chilies, right? Well, if I find that in here, I would assume the chilies will be in here, too. I wanna pop in and out? Oh, there we go. Popping in, in and out of things um, might make a difference. What? Oh, it's the chicken thief. You think you're so smart finding my hideout? Well, you'll never catch me. You think all chickens look alike, don't you? Well, that's a good thing for me and a bad thing for you. Come on, boys. I guess we're too quick for you. Buck, buck. You'll never be able to pick out our leader, Buck Buck. <laughs> what a failure, what a failure. You know, this is quite entertaining. I could do this all day. The problem is they reset. How do I know you're not lying? What if I leave? And come back in as a chicken? Not bad! Okay, we guessed it. Think it's this guy? Okay, you're pretty good. Let's see how you handle this. If 
use the middle. You holy dip! You caught me! Even with all of our ancient poil tricks, we still couldn't fool you. It looks like my days of stealing and hoarding people's stuff are over. Fine, Luchador, take your prize. Look, my mark! Sweet! A little more heart. That's what this game needs, a little more heart. Well, I saw the chicken thief. And the, uh... And the luchador. Kalaka, player uno. You know... <laughs> so you know someone with a taste for the hottest chilies? Such a brave soul, I accept the challenge. Besides, my chilies only belong in the best recipes. Here, take some, you only need a few. That is freaking awesome. Ghost chilies. <laughs> yes! Chicken thief. I took care of the chicken thief. We don't need to worry about that anymore. Is this uh, our cook? No? What's this? Um, is anyone there? They were building this house and I guess I didn't move fast enough so they built it around me. Go downstairs. And then... Boom! I am error. Seriously though, I clearly don't belong here. Tell my sister that I'm fine. She doesn't have to worry about me. I rather enjoy standing off to the side of two rooms. That was it? We, we solved the problem? Okay. We are on a quest spree, man. Thanks for finding Error. He's fine where he is for now. At least I know he's safe. Thanks for going through all that trouble. Here, I don't know what it's worth, but please accept this as your reward. Is it a skull? Nope, more heart. That's freaking awesome. Teddy's tacos. Isabella, she's got the chilies. Gracias, senor. You are now part of history. You have helped me create the world's largest and best enchilada. All right. Well, thank you so much, my dear good lady. Um, Dad Gum. Dad Gum. Um, let's go find the Olmec statue. Casa crashes, I love it. And it's just skulls in the other world. Is it back here? Yes, I would like to take a trip. Um, can I go to El Infierno? Okay, we're gonna go to Desert Desierto Ooh. Caliente. No liquids over three ounces. <laughs> it's the Guacamole TSA. Um, we want to go to El Infierno. But, ow, was it down there in that door, that skull door? It very well could be. I think there's a door up here we want to go to first. And then, down, and then chicken. Do we not have the... Was there something like a blue over here that we didn't go back to? No? Because we've been here. The question is, if we've been here, why didn't we do this already? Oh, hey! Why, hello there! You must be wondering what I'm doing in this guano stinking cave. Well, I just happen to be looking for an adventuresome looking person like yourself. I have a business proposition for you, Luchador. See this mysterious old door? 
Nobody really knows where it leads, but something terrible must have happened there. It looks like the door to one of those hidden realms of Chakmu, but those were ancient places of mystical power. Who could have caused such damage to such a place? And what's that smoky smell? I don't think it's just the guano. Anyway, who knows, right? There's probably some cool stuff going on down there. But to break through such magical rubble, you would certainly need some... Dinamita Espectral. <laughs> it's a magical explosive, quite rare. Me? Oh, why, yes, I have a stick right here. And I'm not the sort to venture into these kinds of places myself, so... Uh, a hundred? I'll purchase it. Pleasure doing business with you. Please, you do the honors. What? Nothing happened? Weird. Honestly, I haven't used magical explosives before. Maybe you did it wrong. Nope, we blew the, we blew the gates to the underworld. Alright, I guess we're going in. Hell Infierno. I'm sure it's hell. I like it by the way, out the flames licking at my feet. Uh oh. What is he waiting for? Oh! Yep, it's fun to go down into hell. Well, this is all closed off unless we're in the dead world, right? Yep, okay. No more transitions back and forth. <laughs> it's nice to know that some mining equipment made it. And look, some trees froze over. What in the world is this going to end up being? You think there's an old mech statue in here? Because we certainly ain't jumping our way out of this. We just keep falling down and down and down. <laughs> the whole town. Oh, a luchador. How did someone... How did you get down here? Someone checked your papers. A huge hole in the wall. Right. <sighs> well, you can thank Kalaka for that. Well, you're in El Infierno now. El Diablo once kept this place running very smoothly, but since Kalaka's uprising, he's missing, and it's pandemonium around here. And it's all, yep, still stay in the dead world. I mean, it makes sense. Why would we not be in the dead world? I don't think that was a door. There's the devil again. El Diablo used to run this place from atop that huge tower back there. I've never been above the third floor, but I heard he has a really sweet office. This place is so disorderly since Kalaka teamed up with that sorceress and escaped. Say what you will about El Diablo, but he kept things predictable. The torture kind of sucked, though. Yeah, I can see that. This isn't much fun. I find myself Karen less and less. <laughs> this and Karen more hell references. The devil's advocate law firm. <laughs> they say Kalaka raised his army from spare bones lying around. So the skeletons invading your world are puppets, and not people. Even if he hadn't destroyed our bookkeeping system, I wouldn't have thrown the census records completely out of whack. But he did. But did he give one thought to the hassle he was causing? Not very likely. Selfish, right? Not to mess with the bureaucracy of hell. Six, six, nine. It's crazy around here these days. I'm pretty sure I saw a rooster run by earlier. Maybe it's, like, someone's pet? Nope, that's the devil rooster. How do you think I stay so lean? The ball and chain is actually a pretty good workout. And the torture helps too, right? Uh, I want to purchase. Um, stamina delay boost? Sure. Stamina regen boost? Sure. Um... I don't need any of that. Alright, we'll come back to some more chunks and stuff later. Kalaka does not have the proper permits to be raising an undead army down here. If El Diablo were still here, he would be losing it. Elevator, elevator, elevator. Blasted. 
button. Open this door. I have work to do. Oh, luchador. I was just examining this elevator. My elevator, which is broken to my office, which is filled with very important documents. I've just returned from my little hiatus in the world above, and I'm noticing some tiny changes Kalaka has made around here. For example, he seems to have rigged these door locks to some sort of arbitrary achievement system involving all the old torture rooms upstairs. I don't know if he did this uh, to train his soldier or as a sick joke, or what, but I can't do much about it in my current form. You know, it's funny to see you here, Luchador. Quite a coincidence, really. After I helped you out of such a difficult predicament up in the desert, suddenly you arrive in El Invierno, all muscular and able-bodied. Seems almost like fate, right? Well, why don't you just head on up to the torture chambers and let me know how it goes? Uh, I guess I can do that. How do I do that? Just keep going on up, huh? I thought the elevators would have done it, but... Why did I slide up like that? I don't know. Pizza 1, Pizza 2, Pizza 2, Pizza 2... A rooster came by and started clucking and flapping at me earlier. I had to physically shoot away to get back to work. Oh, you just shoot your boss. Challenge 1. Race to the goal as quickly as you can. Uh-oh, this is all challenge stuff. Silver, not bad. I'm taking it. Didn't say I had to get gold. Challenge two. Defeat all the enemies to get the highest combo. 200 hits, my goodness. Okay. Mess it up. Yeah, I did great. Awesome. Super good. I didn't do terrible at all on that one. Challenge 3. Use the environment to defeat these invincible enemies. Go. Oh, okay. What was that for?
little monkeys. Alright, goodness gracious. I'm a bronze, I'm a bronze metal man. Carefully time dodges to get through the thorns. Okay. Like right there. <laughs> I keep landing on the dang thing. <laughs> we like made it so close like four times. Oh, that was terrible. We'll just keep going. Survive the waves of enemies as long as you can. If too many enemies pile up on the bridge, it will collapse. Gosh darn it. Four seconds, yeah. Woo, super duper. I'm a bronze metal man all the way down. <laughs> Defeat the enemies without dodging. Okay, go. Without dodging, huh? It'll be hard. I just gotta take my finger off that button. Crazy, yeah. To make this happen. That's not what I wanted. For once, you gotta do the right thing. That's what I wanted right there. Can't dodge, so you just gotta make do. Is it all about combos? Challenge seven. Jump to any moving platforms as fast as possible. Blah 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 blah. blah. Yep, super. Too bad. Oh, 
That was pretty good, actually. Silver. It wasn't gold good, but it was better than bronze good. Challenge eight. Defeat your enemies without your special moves. Okay. Now I gotta lay off the B button. makes the plants a little bit trickier. A little bit, not terrible. Come on. There we go. No spikes from you. Nice that you can dodge, but I can body slam. Silver, sweet. How many challenges are there, I wonder? Challenge nine, special move to avoid the hazards. Oh, this is gonna be fun. Wow, that's just not working for me at all. Oh, we had a kind of... Okay, that was just one part of it. What the frick am I supposed to do here? I only have two jumps. I I I, I only have two jumps. <laughs> I don't know what to do there. Okay, okay. Well, we got through it. The red, the red was a giveaway that I didn't that I didn't get right away. <laughs> no throws. All right, just lots of punching. And special moves. Oh, I can actually transition into the live realm here. No throws, Oh, it's not even letting me throw, so I can't, like, accidentally mess it up. I do. 
my brand new foes. LeBron, but we got past it. That's all I can. That's all I can do. You know, rumbling in the distance. Something unlocked. Use your special move to navigate the portal room. I supposed to do that? Was I supposed to be a chicken in the end? <laughs> The master. I I changed into a chicken. What happened? Okay. Wow. Did it. Get a gold just for completing that one. Okay. Challenge 12, find a way to permit, okay. Just find a way, huh? What? That's one. Two. Really? difference between the dropping the dropping and the uppercut is frustrating it's really frustrating whoa what the frick happened there nope I want to power uppercut up I want to charge forward, power uppercut up. There we go. There we go. Woo! 30 seconds. Who did that in 30 seconds? Probably lots of people, just not me. Um, and we can't get past this, so... 
we're done here for now. Let's go talk to El Diablo. Oh, wow. Would you mind leaving that door open? The AC is busted. That's always been busted. Yeah, I don't know. We really don't have to do El Diablo's work anymore. I only just kind of feel bad for the guy. At this point, I'm just riding Steve's stream of consciousness and waiting for someone else to notice. A bird, a boat, a bird bot. Hard to starboard. This is actually pretty good stuff. Now that the tyrant Diablo is out of the picture, I have so much more time to type my manifestos. Some days these sheep around me will wake up too. No devils, no masters. You there, please help me. Can you tell me what my action items are? Please, I just want to synergize one more time. It's been so long. I guess I should be working, but I've been uh, typing a picture of a house instead. Check it out. <laughs> it's kind of a house. Huh? That's a chimney with smoke. This is a challenging medium, okay? Wow, some money, huh? I mean, it's not the worst thing that could have happened. So I would need four silvers and at least one gold to get out of here, which I've got one gold. Or no. It's telling me I would need more silvers and gold. That's probably not going to happen. I don't intend on spending this uh, Let's Play repeatedly grinding challenge levels. Uh, I more care about how we get out of here. Yes, I would like to leave, sir. Um, let's go to... Let's go to Forest Del Chivo. I want to look and see if we're missing anything. Um, we probably should wait until we get the purple. Actually, we should. We should wait till we get the purple. Sierra More. Can I go there? No. Um, okay, so we'll go to the Canal de las Flores, go to Pico de Gallo, then go to Sierra More. That's what we want to do. Okay, well, we will pick up here next time uh, and we'll make our way. Uh, actually, we'll make our way grabbing some things because I see some stuff that we can grab. Um, but uh, Pure Critic Guy is the ultimate destination. Guys, thank you so much for watching. Hope you're enjoying this, and I'll see you next time. Take care.